Hi and welcome back to my channel and if it's your first time here, welcome, my name is Simone. Today I'm just doing a quick walk around the Grove Mall in Vintuk, Namibia. I didn't go in any shops except for Toys R Us, which you will see later on. We had a bit of a walk around in there. I will put a timestamp down below if you want to fast forward to that part. And then we also just pop in Wimpy and this is before we left Vintuk, which is the capital of Namibia. Um, and we went back down to the coast where we're staying. So if you are new here, my name is Simone and I am an English mum of three and I'm married to Ryan who you see in this video and he is from Namibia. So he had been living in England since 2007. I was born in England. Um, up until four months ago we was living on the Isle of Man where we'd been living for four months. Not four months, sorry, for four years. I will leave a playlist of our time over there if you'd like to check it out and also a playlist of um, us being here in Namibia for the last four months and I also have another playlist from when we visited almost five years ago which is on my son's channel if you'd like to check that out as well so this mall we visited and we vlogged nearly five years ago and I really really like it it's a very big mall if any of my subscribers are watching from the UK then this mall reminds me of the Trafford Center like a smaller version of it it is lovely there's so many shops and one thing that I've noticed unless things have changed since I've been back home there aren't any like empty spaces for shops um, there's shops there's like clothes shops toys pans juice bar coffee shops banks um there's a spa shop the spa shop is a lot different to the spa shops that i'm used to back home um where i used to live in england the spa shop, spa shop would be just like a small place where you could just get a couple of things get some sandwiches get your lotto and things like that but here they are super stores they're like big supermarkets so you can go and get your weekly shop from there and one thing i've noticed as well as at the spa shop is there's a lot of like German items and like European cheeses um, there's a wide variety of different things and at the spa shop here which is near another mall um, which is called the Moreau Mall they've got like a big organic section and loads of different vegan items and they've even got Oatly and other brands that I'm familiar with in the UK um, if you'd like me to film in there the next time I go to Vintuk then please let me know um, so yes like I said we're just having a walk around here we spent the weekend in Vintuk and I will leave that video above if you'd like to check it out um, this cotton on store I believe it's an Australian um, company they have really lovely clothes in there I'm sorry you might be able to see my son here in the background um, they've got really nice like um, men's clothing women's clothing like tops jeans vests dresses so much to choose from um, some of the brand shops here I haven't seen back in the UK um, there's like a shop called Freshini. I've never heard of that brand before in the UK. Um, there's Mr. Price. They have a sports shop, a normal regular clothes shop um, for like men, women and children. And then they also have like a home shop and it's great. They've got like um, pillows, um, bedding, candles, mirrors, plates, forks, knives, loads and loads of lovely stuff. Um, we didn't bring anything over here when we moved. We just literally put everything into nine suitcases. So when we arrived, we needed to get forks, knives, furniture, you name it. And Mr. Price Home is one of the places that I really liked um, visiting. So here on the right, um, you might have seen that there was a slow town coffee they do beautiful coffee there and then there's an ice store and then outside here where we're gonna go now there's some like eating places but this was in the morning and no one was open um, yeah but they've got like an Italian at the end where we went to last time and then there's also another place called Rock and Mama's and they do burgers and waffles and things like that I just want to apologize to anybody who's watching this video who's maybe from Namibia and has already been to this um, mall before and I'm just you know just talking away but a lot of my subscribers are from the UK and from America so I just wanted to talk about the different places that we've been visiting since we've been here so I didn't go um, 
right i don't think there's a lot more shops on the right we was in a bit of a rush i would have liked to do uh, all the way from one end to the other and then down at the bottom if it's be, if it's something that you'd be interested in in the future i'd be more than happy when i'm going back there to visit my in-laws to film again but they've got a cinema just there where ryan's arm is and um, we haven't been to that yet though and then down here there's a place called Dischem which really reminds me of Boots back in the UK so they've got um, loads of like perfumes, makeup, toiletries, vitamins, loads of different stuff um, I like going there and getting like tubs of rolled oats they have oat milk, soy milk, almond milk, nuts, um, seeds magnesium spray relaxers curly hair products they've even got like electrical items and things like that it's a really good shop so here we are going into toys r us um i don't know if they've reopened the toys r us back in the uk but i remember um that the one that was the closest to us had shut down so caleb hadn't been to a toys r us in a long time and he couldn't wait to go and have a look in this store so they had so much to choose from um they had like um you know like the baby section with the prams and cots and breastfeeding things and all of that but i didn't show that bit we just had a look at all of the toys Wait, what is happening what? I never thought that. The loop, the loop, the loop. How would that be for you, Show. Oh, mommy. Oh, Mike really enjoyed seeing all the Hot Wheels here. What I'm going to do now is I think I will just play some music for you guys, and then after we've been here, we nip to Wimpy. I remember going to Wimpy when I was a kid in the UK. If you've been to Wimpy before, then please leave me a comment down below. Um, they do breakfast there and all sorts of stuff. But like I said, it's just a quick video, a um, little clip that I put in at the end. Um, next time, like I said, we're going to be going trampolining and also to an amusement arcade. If you are new here, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel. And if you are returning, thanks so much for supporting my channel. I really appreciate it. So I'm just going to um, let the video play. And yeah, I'll see you in my next one. There. Right, what what is it that you want to look at? Look, look at this. What is it? Next one. Oh my goodness. I am the one. It's my one. Then I'm the other one. Oh, look at the cars over there as well, Mikey. Look. Mum, I really want it. Mum, I really want it, Mum. The creator by bits. Mum, I really, really want it. Bikes. Ooh, Mummy. That's for babies. Oh, look, go kart. There's a go kart there, guys. Whoa. <laughs> you have to show Dad that, Micah. For me. Where's Dad gone? Oh, Neighbor, look, they've got all princess dresses and Barbie. Oh, 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 oh.
Got a dopamine rush, got a major league crush when you're next to me Got my heart upon my sleeve, can I hide the way I feel when you're next to me, girl? Ha, 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 ha.